is Natalie and welcome back to my channel. Oh, look how cute. Today we have an unboxing to show you. Let's get right into it and see what we have. This is a small package and oh no, looks like they arrived. Well, maybe not. They did, they arrived broken. So these are those extra large trays that you can get from Huacan or from anywhere on AliExpress. They're the larger ones compared to the small bolts that you get. But it looks like to me, they came broken. See that? Because this one is not. So that's disappointing. We waited all this time to get these and they're broken. So that's frustrating. And there's the broken pieces to proof. So that's a disappointment. I do believe I got these from Who Can. So I guess I'll be writing them a letter and saying, yep, please send me new ones because these came broken. So that's really disappointing. They're not cheap too. So put that aside. All right, the next thing we have is a canvas. I ordered this from Hula Can. Let's take a look at it. I'll give you all the details when I do my post review on it once I get it completed. The box is a little bit mangled. Can't blame the seller for that one. We've got a enjoy our lovely postal service. But at least it did come in a box. It did come on a foam roll. So that probably is what protected it. Okay, we've got our normal tools. We've got the nice tweezers, which I would have been hoping to get because my First order I got with who can didn't come with them. We got our boat, our wax, our pen, and it looks like a multi-tool. So that's pretty cool. So, so far I give the shipping a five star. I give the tools a five star as far as my trays, but that's okay. At least one of them's good. I'll just write the letter, write the seller and send a picture of it to describe it. So here are the tools, or the, excuse me, the diamonds. There are a lot of them. And it looks like I have a loose bead. And the funny thing is it's a round bead and this is supposed to be square, but the diamonds are definitely square. So it looks like there's gonna be some fun blues and greens in here. So I'm excited to do this one. I will give you an update on the inventory once I do my post review. So let's just quickly get into the canvas. At least their canvases do come up, come rolled really nice. So even though the box is mangled, at least the canvas looks in really good condition. So we got this like tape on here. that without cutting anything. I wish who can came with an inventory sheet. That would be really nice, but they don't, but can't always win. Okay, this canvas is a 45 by 60. And there's the foam roll. too big. You always worry when you get these they are going to be gigantic. All right, so as I've learned from watching other YouTube videos, the one in particular was Ella from Kicking Cancer's Butt. I learned how to flatten out the canvas. I'm just going to do that really quick. 
The canvas looks really good. Symbols are clear. Oh, mother. This looks like it's gonna have lots of confetti. Don't we all just love the confetti? Does look like the canvas got bent right here. But I bet after laying flat for a while, that should come out okay. Doesn't look like the glue is rolled up or anything like that. Sorry about this, just give me one more moment to get this taken care of so it'll lay down flat. And then I will show you what we've got. This one has been, was a fun one that I found. Um, I actually did a puzzle on this. Um, on jiggity.com. And it was really cute. And so when I saw it as a diamond painting, I'm like, I gotta have that. Oops, tearing the paper, which is a big no-no. So yeah, the canvas is looking really good. Let me give you a peek at that, but you can kind of guess what it's gonna be. But it looks really good, really clear. A lot of confetti. done here just one more little teeny tiny strip I really like how these come in strips I have a couple 30 by 45 that's just one strip and it is a pain I find myself just wanting to rip the whole thing off okay so again this was by this was from who again it is a 45 by 60 it has 40 colors And this is what the picture will look like when I'm done. It's a peacock. <laughs> a peacock cat. A, who knows what you want to call it. I'm going to call it a peacock. The cat cock doesn't sound very good. So definitely we're going to stick with a peacock. So it has lots of fun colors. I'm really going to have a lot of fun with this one. So anyway, I give everything a five stars from Who Can. The only thing I'm not happy with is the trays, the fact that they are broken. And what's the purpose of having a big tray with high sides if it's broken? Your beads are just gonna fall right out of it. So I will be writing the seller to get a replacement and hopefully they'll come in better shape. So anyway, that is my unboxing for you today. And as soon as I get the painting completed, we'll do a post review and I'll tell you what I felt about it. Um, if I had all the inventory, how the drills were, and those things. So anyway, hope you guys have a great day, and we'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.